I think I messed up these quays or keys or whatever this is called. Or the floor of the river because it keeps creating waves. Look at this. And it keeps flooding this area. Not just this area, that area as well. So I don't know if these waves are caused temporarily by something I've done. So I don't know. Anyway, welcome to a new episode of Cities Floodlines Skylines. Yeah, I need to f try to fix this. Although I don't really know how, but I'll figure it out, right? You guys, you guys trust me to fix this, don't you? Yes, of course you do. Let's try to flatten this uh, this land next to the wall. And then... Uh, why don't I make it as deep as this one? Actually, I can make it like this and then... yes. Let's see... How much crap am I going to make to my city? Making this river even deeper. <laughs> If the river stayed calm like this, this would be okay. Look, this is a nice size, but then something happens. Oh, you know what it could be? This water thing here. Maybe a lot of people flush at the same time. Could be, you know. That would create a wave, because it would release so much water. Uh, okay, let's abandon the theory. <laughs> but the short of it is, I don't know what's happening here. There we go, there we go, and we have a flood. Why is the river behaving like this? It looks so weird, because some places it looks like it's tall and the others not so much. Although actually making the, the river a bit deeper seemed to have fixed it. Uh, I'm not sure it's going to work the same way here. I don't know which one is the deepest. I guess this is the deepest. Yeah, okay, let's try then. Hmm. This part here in the middle should be the deepest, right? And then this, um, this land should protect. Yeah, okay, this should be enough. Good enough, I hope. Yeah, so like this should have a way to flow a bit more naturally. I can only hope. Although I probably should still raise this anyway. Yeah, this curve here probably... Oh! Water gets trapped here. I should probably do this, shouldn't I? That means I need to destroy some of these things. Yeah, let's do that. There's no point delaying the inevitable. <laughs> Okay, this doesn't look good at all. <coughs> it doesn't look good at all. And it still overflows here. <sighs> oh well. 
I just need to wait a bit to see if this is going to stabilize or not. Why? Oh, because I didn't connect these two things, is it? Oh no, because there was a road here. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. This really doesn't look good. Why does it... Why does it make that... Um... Curve. Okay, better. Much better. Although this is a bit crooked, but it's okay. <coughs> Sorry. Now... Oh yeah, reconnect this road to here. Uh, can we do that? Can we actually connect this here? We can. Perfect. Yes, perfect. Okay, not too bad. Now I just need to rezone this. And everything's going to be alright. Or not. Oh no, I cannot put this because this is too noisy. Let's put commercial buildings instead. Yeah, much better like this. Okay, we have a little bit of floods in here. How are we here? Okay, this seems much better around here. Let's unpause this. Let's see if we have no more issues anywhere else. Okay. The vacuum trucks or whatever they are called, they should take care of this. Just hope this was a permanent fix. It does look like it. Yeah, it does look like it. Although here it gets yeah, so many waves. And look how how deep this gets here. <laughs> yeah. Terraforming rivers is not my strong suit, that's for sure. Yeah. Where are the trucks? The vacuum trucks? The um, flood symbols. The pop-up notifications keep appearing here, but I don't see any trucks. I guess now it's gone. Yeah. Okay, I think one less problem in this city. And one day I'll come back here and... <laughs> and actually try to create a lake. <laughs> or shall I do it now? Let's do it now. Yeah. Because what I want to do is to continue to expand the industry and reorganize this a bit. Because it has a lot of traffic here. Although it's not backing up too much. But yeah. Yeah, let's make this episode a water episode. Oh, 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 what do we have here? What's your problem? There's a garbage a recycling center right here. What's your problem? Do I need to put another recycling center? I guess I can do that. I guess I can do that. So where are you going? You have to go all around here and then here to come here, I guess. Yeah, looks like it. What? You don't have oil. Why don't you have oil? This guy is full of oil. I really don't don't understand the flow of resources in the industries. There's so much oil. I mean, so much oil. There was a bit more than... Hmm, maybe I do need to produce more oil. Because now we have two plastic factories. Oh. Let me check how is the plastic situation here. Yeah, still a problem. Still a problem. But I expanded this so much, or at least I thought it was so much. With all these trucks here. 
Do I need to expand even further? Let's take a quick look. Hmm. I guess I could. I can try. To, since these don't seem to get in um, each other's way in terms of the production rate. I don't know if you recall, but uh, when we were plopping this, there's a radius. You see, they have this radius. I thought this radius would mean that they interfere with each other, but actually, they don't. So I'm going just to spam a few then. If I can squeeze some in. Yes. This one, yes. Okay, let's see if this is enough. Look, this is full of oh, it's petroleum. Oh yeah, that's fine. There's only one petroleum factory, and that should be enough. We definitely need to produce more plastics. We have so many trucks. These trucks can all come here and here. Maybe I should populate this a bit more, like, like here. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Because it seems that we need a lot of oil to produce plastics. Shocking, right? I know. Who would have thought? Good to have you back. Oops, no, not so far. Okay. okay, this should be enough. Uh, what I want to do here? I want to spam this. I, I guess I do. I guess I do. Right now I'm more focused on production rather than uh, aesthetics. When we stabilize this, I might come here and just reorganize all of this. Doesn't look too bad. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. And hopefully oil won't be a problem anymore. This is the tank. Shall I build a huge tank? Yeah, shall I do that? Kinda like... Well, so many trucks. <laughs> Kinda like here. Uh, it seems to be a bit away from everything. The only reason why I don't want to put it around here is because uh, there's still more minerals here to extract and here there's nothing. Yeah. I'll just plop one here, see how it looks. It looks a bit weird with this slope, but maybe it won't be that bad. Yeah, <laughs> it's getting pretty busy. It's getting very, very busy. We're still flowing nicely. And I definitely need to put trains, cargo trains there is, to take some uh, some of these uh, trucks out of the road. Okay. And now, I think things are stabilized, are they? Yeah, no more floods. Yeah, I think everything is stabilized. Oh, this one. Does it need to be emptied? Let's take a quick look to see if there are any warnings, symbols that we need to pay attention. No, it doesn't look like it. No. I still need to come here and make this garden a bit more pretty. This is a bit weird, this slope, but okay. Yeah. So many things still to do in this city, my god. What are you guys complaining about? Plastics, 
plastics, plastics, and glass. Okay, why are you complaining about glass? Now I need to improve this. Oh, there's so many things to do. I probably need to. But okay, never mind. That's going to be for the next episode. Right now, this episode is the water episode with a few tangents to deal with issues that pop up. So I'm going to put the water. Oh my god, <laughs> the remains from failed attempts on the past. Okay, let's clear this and this and this and I messed up. Okay, pause. Why did I mess up? Because some of these are not connected, is it? It must be it. Okay. okay this should be okay now. Let's connect all of these just in case. Come on. Don't tell me there was just one pipe that was linking the whole city. Holy crap. By destroying this pipe, I basically cut off the water supply to the whole city. Holy crap. I probably need to yeah, create a few more connections. Me and water. Crazy. Not a big deal because we can quickly identify what the issue is, but still. Okay. And maybe it's the universe telling me Eflux, don't touch this. Let Bob and his friend that I don't remember the name <laughs> fish fishes from the sky. Or from uh, an empty hole. No, but we need to fix this. It's time. We need to be brave. And we need to put some fresh water. Where is it? Is this fresh water? Yes. So let's put it right on the deepest end of the pool. Right here. Now we will connect this in a kind of straight line to this one. Yes. And it needs that stuff. So what I can do is power there was something I can use. Let me pause this first. Where was it? Emergency. No, oh, it's this one. Yeah. So I can put one of these earthquake sensors like here. Will that help at all? Not really, I need to put another, then I put another one, I guess, here. Where is it? And I can put one here. And another one right here. Okay, this should connect things, let's see. Yes. Oh, but then it throws this error. Okay, then maybe if I plop it here. This building has collapsed. <laughs> okay, so this building cannot be underwater. But it still works, apparently. Does it? Oh, it does. Perfect. Okay. So that's that. And then we need to pause this and put a water pump. Oh, I mean, we can try. We can definitely try. Okay. Oh, this is going to look so ugly. Well, if it works, even if it looks ugly, screw it. Hopefully it will work. I guess we just leave it. So this produce this pumps 120 and this one. Okay. 
I guess this is not going to. It's not going to work, is it? Probably not. Let's start with doing stupid things again. Yes, why not? Okay, it's filling up quite nicely, I should say. Now it's time to disable, uh, I mean to enable the water pump. See if it stabilizes. Ooh, so close. Oh no, oh no, <laughs> no, no. Oh, it was so close. Damn it, <laughs> look at this. Ah, <sighs> I was just a few seconds too late, but Bob seems to be okay. Oh no. Oh no, come on, water pump, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no, I was really, I, I was speeding this up and I was staring at this, not completely, not 100% of the time, but 90% of the time I just have, I'm sitting in front of the screen looking at the water level and I was like okay now it's time to turn off so I start recording or I start talking to the microphone and well the rest you guys saw <sighs> so is it pumping the water probably not let's turn off a couple yeah, I'm not going to turn off more. The water level should start to go down very soon. In the meantime... <laughs> oh God. I really suck at this. Well, at least I'll give some work to the... Where they are? To the vacuum trucks. Come on, this is this should be pumping. Yeah, it should be taking water out, right? So soon this is going to stabilize. And I already disabled two. Okay, maybe I just do something. Okay, let's just do a quick readjustment of this. So it stops. Right, as soon and as soon as this goes bit more down I turn this back up I just wanted this to stabilize but the problem is that this number is not the drain capacity okay 
it's starting to stabilize go a bit lower okay there's no point all of us being staring at this okay i think it's just going down i was going to do a cut here and come back later but now i think it's time to turn this back on so now this should be stabilized if we have 24 Oh no, it's, al it's already started flooding as soon as I got damn it. Okay, then I just need to turn on one at a time, is that it? Okay. I was going to do some quick math, so... Uh, it was 24, so 2 is 48, 4 is 96. Oh, wait a second, yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, okay. So this, I, I definitely don't need this anymore. So I have one, two, three, four, five. Five times 24. Let me get my calculator. <laughs> um, uh, 24 times five equals 120, which is exactly this okay cool so five should now keep this stable okay that's it it's five is the magic number that's it so now the water capacity lets out oh yeah okay this should now be perfect balance Oh uh, no, it's filling up. Why is it filling up? God damn it. Why is it filling up? It should be flawless. Why is it filling up? Did, did I do the, the math wrong or what? Okay, let's do this again. 5 times 24 equals 120. And this is 120. Ugh, I, don't, I don't get it. Okay, I'm just going to, maybe it's because I do them all at once and it takes some time. So I'm going to just do one. Okay. And what do we have here? Now it's both petroleum and plastics. What's the problem with this? We should be producing a lot of this. Why aren't we producing a lot of plastics? Do I need to produce to produce to build another plastic factory? Yeah, let's do that. Let's build another plastics factory. Where is it? This petrochemical plant, I should have said. And maybe I do another oil sludge. Okay. Look how many trucks are now here. <laughs> yeah, so it tells me I'll need to redesign this. Probably the cargo trains will do the trick. If I put, for example, here or somewhere around here yeah now, let's see anyway let's go back to our water challenge and now the drain okay pause let's turn on two more so now we have a total of three it seems to be filling up and the reason why i'm saying this is you see this rock thing here it was barely touching it and now it's clearly touching it. Yeah, seems to be going up. Seems to be going up. Uh, damn it. Off. Okay, then I just leave two. Okay, I'm not going to destroy them. I'm just going to leave them like this. 
see if we do it stabilizes. It seems to be still filling up, look. You know what I've been thinking occasionally? Is that instead of doing this, I can just maybe create a canal and let the water level itself. But now it seems to be okay actually. Okay, let's leave this here and uh, on the next episode we will focus on industry because clearly we have some unbalance going on and I need to sort that unbalance out and um, we'll also need to expand here for forestry it's the only industry that we don't have and then we need to optimize the cargo transports with trains and stuff oh wow okay okay yeah we definitely need to change this yeah look how many trains do we have here just for cargo look at this holy crap look at this yeah i need to revamp my cargo train this is becoming cargo train network i mean this is clearly a bottleneck right here not so much for trucks although trucks also participate heavily in this oh wow i need to create a huge a huge cargo train network yeah i need to create some alternatives i don't know exactly what I need definitely create one from here to here, another one to here, because I will want the, this, yeah, the harbor, the trains from the harbor, to have, to not have to go all the way through here to get here or there. Yeah. Yep. I created the. Oh no. Oh no. We have floods. It's still going up. Okay. I will turn off the fourth one then now there's only one of each and <laughs> this person passed through oh did you see that person going into the water okay it was a bit uh, weird but okay yep yeah. anyway we have a lot of work to do look at these trains Look at all of this backing up here and here. So that's what's going to happen next episode. It's not going to be industry expansion or adding the forestry industry, but it's going to be reorganize the cargo trains. And what I'll need to do is to put multiple connections. I need to create another hub here and make this connect to the ore and uh, oil industry and the future forestry and I, I will still leave this as is I think if I create more if I connect these things by train I think it will offload a lot of the traffic that's coming here and potentially I need to create another line not another line well technically yes it's another line so that this the, the train, the cargo train that connects to the center of the city so it can connect to here not having to grow to go to this part or maybe I can just do a separation here yeah I still don't know exactly how I'm going to do this but I hope I'm making some sense this is the root of all evil that uh, all the exports need to come through here I reckon as soon as I create another export a uh, cargo train uh, option here it's going to really offload everything and uh, probably that's what I'm going to start to do start simple I'm going to connect this this and this and then see how things progress and if needed I will then create alternatives um, to reach the center maybe to connect like directly through here although this already exists yeah I think I think when I do this things will improve anyway I'm rambling apologies guys um, let's wrap up this episode it's been a, a bit long longer than I had planned oh my god look at this look at this flow of traffic amazing yeah <coughs>
<coughs> oh, sorry. <coughs> um, sorry. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, okay, in a friendly. This is um episode focused on water and a little bit on the industry as well. Hopefully the water situation will stabilize. Now the water is going down. God damn it. Then I'll put the second back. Yeah, I don't think it's going to stabilize. Yeah. I don't know how to do this and stabilize the water, to be honest. But okay. Anyway, for the final time, I'm going to say goodbye. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again on the next episode where we'll hopefully not have a flooded city and we'll be able to focus. Oh no, why is it this helicopter here? Where is the fire? I don't see any fire. Oh yes, I see the fire. Here it is. Here it is. Okay, now it's really going to f to finish. I'm really going to finish this episode. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. And hopefully in the next episode we won't have the city in flames and flooded and all those things. Bye!